getting all up in your business. I ain't want the gossip, so you ain't heard it from me. She's got all the dirt. Oh, my goodness. It's the Visa Report with Michelle Visa on the People Station. 93.7 WBLK. 50 Cent will be trying his hand in a new business venture. The rap star plans to launch his own champagne next year. The rapper has found major success in selling spirits and drinks in the past. In July 2017, 50 reportedly sold shares of his effing vodka for $60 million. He also made hundreds of million dollars when he sold his stake in vitamin water. 50 revealed that he'll be launching the champagne during a sit-down with the New York Times to promote his new movie, Den of Thieves. In theaters this Friday, January 19th. 50's all about his business this is visa approved visa approved comedian tiffany haddish lands a partnership with groupon after her comical swamp story Tiffany went on Jimmy Kimmel Live and told a story about how Will Smith and Jada Pinkett Smith joined her on a swamp tour in New Orleans. She notified them that she was paying for the trip because she got the tickets off of Groupon. And when the head of marketing found out about it, it was a no-brainer to get the partnership with Haddish. Tiffany Haddish also has a Super Bowl ad coming out. I love this woman's story. This is Visa Approved. Visa Approved. The 2018 NAACP Image Awards aired live last night on Martin Luther King Day. Returning as host was the Blackish star Anthony Anderson, who also took home the Best Actor Award in a comedy series. Now into its fourth decade, the NAACP Image Awards have recognized the best in African-American achievements in literature and entertainment. Omari Hardwick took home Best Actor in a Drama Series for Power. Taraji P. Henson also took home a Best Actress Award for Empire. Other big winners include Queen Latifah, LL Cool J, Mary J. Blige, SZA, Notori Naughton, and Kendrick Lamar. Keep representing for the people. This is Visa Approved. Visa Approved. I'm Michelle Visa, and that's your Visa Report. Check out the recap at WBLK.com.